Hello guys, welcome to another exciting video. This is a VAD Academy and we're going to look at uh, paper 1 math 2025 GCE. So this is coming from our uh, functions. So the functions f and g are defined by f of x equals to this and g of x equals to 1 minus 2x. Find a f of x, f inverse of x, b g composite f of x, c g composite f of negative 7. So how do we approach uh, these equations? So the best way to approach the question is that on A, what you have been just told is just to find what you So we are going to say A So meaning uh, f inverse of x. So what this means is that um, whenever you're finding the inverse, okay, whenever you're finding the inverse, guys, so you say um, f of x is equal to t is equal to y, okay? And then meaning what is f of x, I'm going to put y. So now, this implies that y is equal to x plus 3 over 2. Okay? And then now, you make x the subject to the formula. So I'm going to put over 1 there, and then you cross it, multiply. So I'm going to say 1 times x, just x, plus 1 times 3, which is just 3, is equal to y times 2, this will just be 2y. And then from there, we make, we isolate now x is equal to 2y minus 3. Okay, you can see that the y is positive becomes negative. So at this point, you are done. What you're just supposed to do is now say where is x, you put now f inverse of x is equal to where is y now, you put back x minus 3. So uh, this means you are done. Okay, as simple as that. Okay, and then now let's go to uh, to b. Now for B, they are saying G composite F of X, okay? So now what you need to do is whenever you have two functions, okay? So this is more like uh, it's a composite, two functions more like you're multiplying. So what you're supposed to do is, first of all, you write the function, okay? You write the function, um, you're going to say, so you write the function g which is this one okay so i'm going to say 1 minus 2x okay and then now you get the inner function which is f of x you're going to say 1 minus 2 open bracket now you put the f so the function f is which one this one okay x plus 3 over 2 So, from there, I'm going to say x plus 3 over 2, okay? And then now we can start simplifying. So, this is going to multiply uh, with everything. But because of this denominator at the bottom 2, is going to more like divide with that one. So, I'm going to have 1 minus, okay? So when this one goes, one there, then this one, one there. So just remain with something like this. Okay. Now, after that, now, we can still simplify one minus this times that, just x, this times that, just the negative three. 
now from there what you're going to have now is you can now say put these together 1 minus 3 then minus x then from there now 1 minus 3 just negative 2 minus x so this is the answer okay you're going to find now c okay so for c they are saying g f negative 7 okay so what this means is that um uh, g composite f of negative 7 okay now remember here we have uh it's more like we are saying that in g f composite f of negative 7 or let's just say x okay uh, this is this now so now the actual number there the actual number there is in negative 7 which is for x so meaning where there is where there is what um we are going to get this of of this function okay so now we are going to say negative 2 negative 2 minus x okay now we know that x is negative 7 so we are going to get this negative 7 and put it where there is x so this will be negative 2 minus open bracket negative 7 okay and then from there now we can say negative 2 negative times negative is going to be plus this okay so from there now we can just flip this one start with a positive number this minus 2 okay and then from there now 7 minus 2 you are going to get 5 Okay, so that is our answer, and this is how you are supposed to answer question 19 from uh, 2025 GC Math Tip 1. So remember to support, subscribe, guys, for more of these videos, and we have so much for you. Help us to reach more people so that uh, we can help more people. Thank you so much, and this is a radical academy.